Hey, it's Mike from musicradiocreative.com and in this video I'll show you how to cut music in Audacity. Right, here's the blank Audacity screen. I'm going to go into the file menu and I'm going to go to, instead of open, to open one audio file, I'm going to go to import audio. You've also got the option for labels and MIDI and raw data as well. In my case, it's audio from a jingle we've got. So uh, I've got the stems of a Music Radio Creative jingle, uh, the dry bit, the guitars, the logo, the melody, some pads, and a bit of synth as well. Open, we'll import them all in. And I'm going to say make a copy and don't warn me about that again. So it's going to go through and do that. Right. Okay, fantastic. Now we've got all the stems on the screen here as their separate tracks. And you can scroll up and down to see them. If I was to start playing this back, you'd hear a bit of the jingle. A bit more. And finally, you might hear the logo. Now, if I was to uh, mix this down into a new track, what I might do is actually take the gain down by probably minus 10 dB on each track because I can hear that it's horribly beat, uh, um, horribly beating or peaking, <laughs> beating, beating the compressor to death. So let's go down to each track here and very quickly just reduce that volume and see whether we can do anything about that overmodulation. Let's have a listen again. <laughs> And you can see that it is still peaking a little bit, so we might need to go down even further with some of these tracks. So let's go down to minus 15 now on some of the tracks so that we're just not distorting and we're going to have a, a clean master of this track. All right, let's have another listen now. Perfect, so we got no red here on the peak meters when we play back, which is good news. So I'll go into File, and then I want to export the audio that I've just bought in and I want to export it as the MRC Jingle Master and I can choose my file type, I can have WAV, I can have AIFF which is lovely Apple lossless format, I can go for FLAC or OG or OGG if you're open source or MP3 even and click save, choose my presets and it will save that as one file so I mix all those tracks together and I've cut some music inside Audacity in a matter of minutes.